Can you stop comparing mine to yours? I have but one desire. Ow. Okay, hello, welcome back to today's video. So, it is the, what is it, the second last day of the holiday before we go back to school. So, me, and what's your name? <laughs> what's, what's your no. name? She has no name. But today we're gonna be painting um, Bokuto and Ni Nishinoya from which anime is this? Haikyuu. From Haikyuu. So I have painted before, just a little bit. Monica. Always seen denim. And then Mon I haven't. Monica has never painted, so we're all gonna die. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna paint side by side next to each other. I've never drawn anime, but we're gonna paint next to each other. We're gonna see who can do it the best. So actually, we ended up changing our mind and doing butterflies instead. But just enjoy the process. I think it's quite even because I've never painted anime and she's never painted. I've never drawn. She's never drawn, so I think it's even. Will it go well? I don't know. I don't think so. We shall see. We just <laughs> try and enjoy it. So have you have you drawn before? No. Okay, so we're gonna try. Okay, draw a circle. Let's see. <laughs> Let's just, just just see what we're working with. <laughs> draw a circle. How big? By any size. Yeah. Let's go. Come on, you can do it. How do you draw a circle? <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh my God! Wow! Beautiful. There we go. That's see. Now I can draw a face. So easy. I can't mess it this up. Yeah, first I'm just gonna show how to draw quick, very basic faces, and then we shall begin. Okay, so let me show you a few little anatomy basics. So with every face, it comprises usually of a a face comprises of a circle and a smaller circle, and then this line is called the middle line. This is the line of symmetry on their face. Mm -hmm. And then, eyes, and then you split into thirds. And usually the eyes is on the top third, the nose is on the second third, and then the lips is on this third third. Okay, so after a few minutes of um trying to draw Bokuto and Nishinoya, we have decided to um, uh, <laughs> to do butterflies and moths instead. Because it's, it's a lot more fun, you know, easier, not too stressful. I've done butterflies before. This is from my Spongebob Inspire Moth video. So we're going to do the same thing on these. We're going to do butterflies and moths. This girl. Oh my god. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> There we go. There we go. We found it. So she's going to do the... Um, oh, I forgot the name of these butterflies. Marfo. Marfo butterfly. And then I'm doing the lunar moth on our... Oh, well, this is what she drew. <laughs> no. That's what I drew. <laughs> we shall do it again. Okay, so you feel confident about your butterfly? Just got a base done. <laughs> There we go. Easy. Now you just gotta paint it on the canvas. You don't wanna do the body. Oh, you don't have to do the body. But usually the body would look like this. So it's made of three parts. So this is the abdomen, this is the thorax, and this is the head. And usually the thorax is the biggest part of the body. And the abdomen is the thickest one. And then the head is a triangle shape with two dots for the eyes. Just focus it on yours. No. I'm gonna paint 
cops have very hairy bodies. Okay, I'm going to make mine Patrick inspiring. We shall see. Pasta. Hers is going to be pasta inspired. <laughs> very interesting. I think it'll be cool though. Okay, pick your brushes. Shouldn't you tell me what brush should oh, I okay. use? <laughs> <laughs> Give me a brush that I can put dots. Oh, to do dots, usually what I do is I used to put it, put white, and I just oh, okay. like that. applying her first paint strokes. <laughs> when was the last time you held a paintbrush? Never. Never? Okay. I have Virgin experience here. Show us what we've got. Show it to the camera. <laughs> That's all we've got after an hour. She did pretty well. First ever painting. Not bad. This is my one. So. Look at this. Okay, we are. This is like art. <laughs> this is like preschool art. What? <laughs> so I've got so far, we're about, what, it's been an hour? An hour and a half? I don't know. How are you finding the painting? Is it easy? No. <laughs> I stick to cooking. <laughs> That's it so far. to give up painting. I can't give it up because I haven't even started. She gave up before she tried. Nah, she tried. It's going good. We're still not done yet on the break. She had things some of her ramen. What ramen are you having? Show the camera. Yeah. So today I'm having <laughs> red cookie. Very highly saturated. Highly saturated. We then played some guitar just to relax and then we also had a discussion on the sad reality of people not buying stuff from fine art students. <laughs> oh, such a cool... Culinary art to my ass. <laughs> <laughs> Culinary art, fine art. Same thing? We shall art? See. You don't even know how to paint. <laughs> you know how to paint? Well, at least I can paint cake. That's right. That's all you need. <laughs> which one will sell more? Which one's more likely to sell? My art or your cake? Your cake. My cake. <laughs> so there's no trust, there's trade offs there. Yeah, see, there's so many arts. There's fine art, there's culinary arts. But in the end, culinary arts will still sell more because people are more likely to eat than to buy a piece of art. I go. Period! <sighs> That's so sad. And the fact that I'm also part of those people that buys food. Good job.
Makes me more money. Steal my money, this woman. What, what's happening right now? It's a two colored butterfly. <laughs> Are you giving up? <laughs> Are you giving up? It's a pink and purple butterfly. She's really in desperation. She can't even answer my question. <laughs> no, don't give up. You can do it. Just keep going. You didn't finish the other three wings. <laughs> you can do it. That's what I felt so far. Can you stop comparing mine to yours? <laughs> okay, fine! <laughs> Okay, we are done. We are finished. How did you find your first painting? Um, never gonna do it again. <laughs> <laughs> do you wanna show us what you made today? No. Come on. Ta -da. So that's our paintings. I think that's pretty good for a first timer though. She was so good painting it. And then this is I don't know how it got to this, but... <laughs> Okay, not bad. Good job. High five. <sighs> She's probably never gonna paint again. But... <laughs> hey, I had fun. Anyways, until next time. Bye bye. Bye. New one. This is the best one. This is the best one. That's the best one. Art Here you go. Student. You got all the colors. Yay! Challenge. I should ask a lot of questions like how to use the paintbrush and how to apply the paint, but you see, that's why you gotta watch my videos because I teach you how to do that. I watch it. Guys! I watch it. Okay, but. Thank you. No problem. That'll be fine, I promise. <laughs> Don't. Where to find the paint? Really? <laughs> <laughs> Move it. Turn around, do a quick spin. <laughs> We're gonna try and get as close as we can to these images. As close as we can. As close as we can. <laughs> With that!